Anhajerti, 64, has been on the chase since 2010, becoming the first woman on the show and making her one of the show's longest standing chasers. In an interview with Express, Co.UK and was asked if she competes with her fellow chasers and how she feels about her position on the show in a very candid chat. Anne is on the chase alongside Mark Labatt, Sean Wallace, Paul Cena, Jenny Ryan, and Dara Ennis. Express.co.uk asked Anne how she gets along with her co-workers behind the scenes and whether there is any competition involved. She said, we're all friends. It wouldn't really work if we weren't all having a WhatsApp chat where we talk to each other all the time. I mean, nobody wants to be the worst chaser but if anyone is having a bad time we are all very supportive. One of us might suddenly have a bad day and not just lose but lose really badly and it could be any of us. So we're all very mutually supportive of each other. Anne has previously admitted that her favorite part of the show is the presenter, Bradley Walsh, explaining to Express. Co.uk, oh I have too many favorite things. Possibly working with Brad. He is just this legendary presenter, and he is just such a nice guy, all the chasers have such a nice rapport with him. She added, but also the fact that it is a job that I can do. It is sort of tailor-made for me and I can earn a decent living just by doing a few hours of work every day, which is brilliant. So yeah it suits me down to a T. I always say, any time that I am filming for the chase, the actual filming for the chase is the easy part of my day and everything else is more difficult so yeah, I absolutely love it. Anne has also admitted that she finds it impossible to think of anyone else presenting the hit ITV daytime show. When asked whether she thought anyone could ever take Bradley's place as host should he ever decide to step down, Anne appeared reluctant to even dwell on the idea to Metro. Co.uk. She said, it's impossible to imagine. I've sometimes had conversations with Mark when he says, if Bradley leaves, who else do you think could do it? And I'm like, no no no, I can't hear you. I will not entertain that thought. But who knows? I suppose I can think of a couple of people, but it wouldn't be the same without Brad. Anne added that were Bradley to quit, the chasers wouldn't follow in his footsteps but would carry on performing their roles on the program. She promised, if he, please don't, but if he should leave, then well stick around. Anne recently starred in the Beauty and the Beast pantomime alongside comedy impressionist and Britain's Got Talent finalist Paul Burling. He played French Frank while local favorite Dave Ashley returned for his seventh pando at the town centre venue. Speaking about the panto, Anne said, I love panto. Beauty and the Beast is a firm family favourite. I know all of the magical pantomime ingredients will be included for the best night out for the whole family, so, I am so pleased to be creating some of that magic, I can't wait to see you on the stage. <laughs>